This is an AI agent that I just used to fix a $14,000 meta ad campaign. And I wanna show you what it came up with because it's actually really freaking impressive. And just to be clear, this is not a video where I just plug a prompt into a tool like ChatGPT or Claude or whatever else. This is an AI agent built by Dara Denny that lives inside of Motion. And I wanna show you how it works. And then afterward, you can follow these same steps to uncover winning patterns in your ads. And plus maybe find some ways to improve your campaign. All right, let's go ahead and dive in. So I'm gonna start by logging into motion and if you're not a user yet you can actually find a sign up link in the description below and yeah i'll go ahead and click into our top creatives report i'll look back at the last 90 days of performance or so and then yeah once that's done loading i'll see that there's a stack rank of all the ads that got the most spent in the last 90 days i'll go ahead this one looks good i'll pick this one uh this creative here got about 14,000 in spend and i'll use this agent called creative performance analyzer to start analyzing analyzing the ad. And while I'm waiting for the report, I just want to point out how much ad tech has evolved in such a short amount of time. Literally 11 months ago, I made this video right here on how to analyze Facebook ads. And it's the old, old way to do it. It basically involved me studying like 12 different metrics and using them in the spreadsheet to map them out across five different ad elements and then thinking through iteration opportunities. It was just a lot. And then AI came out, right? And I could just upload some spreadsheet data that I exported from Meta, maybe some ad creative, and I would just dump it into an LLM and maybe get a few ideas. And then here we are now, where I'm just logging into Motion. I used Dara's agent with my ad account data at my fingertips. I was created and trained by her, who's a professional creative strategist who's managed hundreds of millions of dollars in ad spend. She's encoded her actual frameworks and decision-making processes into this tool. It's just nuts. It's nuts. Anyway, look, if you're someone who likes to nerd out on this AI stuff like I do, then I want to invite you to come build your own expert agent inside of Motion, just like Dara, and then you can monetize your agent and all that hard earned advertising expertise you have. Check out the link, go to motion.com slash expert dash agents can learn more there. Okay, now let's see what Dara's AI agent came up with. At the top here, I'm seeing the date range. Obviously we had selected. She has a little quick summary of what she saw in our ad. And then if I scroll a bit, I'll see three key insights on what's working well. And I really like this part because now I can just quickly go back to my team right now and say, okay, we should try creating more ads that have comedic storylines framed around a journey that our ideal customers have to go on to be successful. Look, we scaled this creative to 14,000. It, it worked well, let's replicate it. And I just love that it's something very specific to execute on. And if I'm being honest, I probably would have never identified or articulated that insight on my own. Like maybe if I watched every video inside of Dara's YouTube and then spent a week looking at one ad, maybe I'd get there, but that's a stretch. All right, let's scroll down a little bit more. Dara's agent points out that we can make the creative better. Okay, I really like key insight number three here because I hadn't considered this at all, which is when you have a strong comedic hook, it can overshadow next steps. And so maybe a mid-roll CTA is really clever and it would convert viewers better. And I am totally gonna try that now because as a creative, I spend a lot of time on my hooks, but it's a great reminder for me to find ways to bump up my conversions on my ads. All right. Next up, Dara's agent is gonna compare my creative with similar creatives in my account. And I think this is neat because I wouldn't have thought to look at these ads because honestly, I forgot about some of them, but Dara's agent was able to recognize of all these creatives that they have a similar like tackling of this concept from poor results to success. And she points out the different formats that are used within that framework. Like creative two is using a direct tutorial format or creative one and four are leaning into a comedic or bold messaging. Look, overall, the takeaway from doing a comparison is that I should blend big comedy with a strong social proof angle. I would have never thought to articulate it in that way. It's so much smarter and more intentional than I would have been. And bringing back a detailed comparison between one ad and then showing how it's similar and different to below average and above average creative, it's not something I normally do as part of my analysis, but Dara does, she's brilliant. So I'm gonna do that to fix my ad. And then lastly, let's see the key takeaways that Dara's agent has for us based on analyzing this creative. Look, all, all three of these are smart. So after rewatching the ad, I do see that we show the motion tool a decent amount, but we don't necessarily highlight a key feature or call anything out by name. And I think that's a great idea to test. So I'm going to do that. And then there's this recommendation to insert that clear mid creative prompt that will direct viewers to act immediately while keeping them excited and ready to click. And then this last one is just try new angles of frustration to expand on this theme of transformation. Overall, this is just like super mind blowing. It's really impressive at how fast and thorough and structured and actionable all of this is because 
because when I'm creating ads, I'm not as intentional or strategic as I want to be. And something like this is going to help me stay focused and smart about what's actually going into my next ad creative. Anyway, I know a lot of conversations around AI tend to be that you either hate it or you love it. There's no in between, but seeing it in action like this hopefully makes AI agents more approachable and more practical to use for you in ad tech. And I think if a knucklehead like me can get even one good idea from just clicking a button, I think a lot of you are going to see immediate value right away. And if you're running ads for a D2C brand and managing a, a team, something like this is a no brainer. Because think about it, instead of spending months hiring and then training a junior creative strategist, you can just use this expert agent and get incredible analysis done basically instantly. Or someone on your team can use this to really up level them themselves. And for brands who are trying to play that game of like volume and launch dozens of creative variations every week, the biggest benefit of using an expert agent like this is that you can spend time actually executing on creative ideas and not just like sitting in meetings, getting stuck analyzing a bunch of performance data every day. So yeah, if you found this helpful, you can try it out for yourself. Just sign up for Motion using the link in the description. You'll be able to import your meta account and start analyzing all your ads and your data right away. So I'm curious to hear what you think about this AI tool for creative analysis and obviously I'm very excited to see what other agents Dara is going to build because this is just her first one and it's already so useful. Drop a comment below with your thoughts or questions and if you want to build your own agent like I mentioned before check out some of the other expert agents to get that inspirational flowing and just go to motionapp.com expert-agents start building your own.